named Zilla, Blogzilla. And today, we're going to give you an inside look into Spectra. Let's go. Is this really what you want? Living in the shadows, hunting, being hunted, always alone? to think about it. Madeline Swan is the main Bond girl in this film. She's played by Leah Sadu. Leah and I had a great conversation about her role, this new Bond character, and you know how he fits in. He's a little bit more sentimental. Check it out. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, Madeline Swan? Who is she? She's quite enigmatic because she's very different from the other Bond girls. So she's, um, she's not like the stereotype. She's more um, complex and Bond's equal. What's the coolest thing you get to do as, as this character? I have a scene where um, I fight with him. It's nice. Uh, do you fight with him in the snow? Yeah. Then yeah. Was that Austria? Yeah, it was in Austria. How was the shooting there? Was it difficult? Was it cold? It was very cold. It was very high. What should fans expect from Spectre? I think Spectre is going to be spectacular. The movie starts off in Mexico City during El Dia de los Muertos. That's the Day of the Dead celebration. They recreated the entire thing. There was 1,520 extras on set in Mexico. There were 107 makeup artists, 98 of them were local, and it took three and a half hours to get all those people ready. Each jacket was created per person, the dresses. We're really trying to make them all different and always bringing like the death into this costume. Filming in Mexico City took place in three locations. Tulsa Square, El Zocolo and the Grand Hotel. There's a bunch of great, gigantic, big action scenes in this movie, and they do everything real. The tradition for Bond is always real stunts, real action, real explosions. There's nothing made in a computer, and that remains the case here. And so the ultimate goal is the kind of excitement, visceral excitement, you can only get from live stuff. Those big explosions, buildings collapsing. It's a very complicated sequence. We have a lot of special effects and a lot of stunts. So when Daniel's on the rooftop, he's actually on a rooftop in Mexico City. When we have helicopters flying over the square and down the streets, it's a real helicopter actually doing the stunts. So you play the badass Mr. Hicks. Hinks. Yeah, Mr. Hinks. Yeah. Uh, how much percentage of a plan does he have in this movie? I mean, Hinks is all planned. <laughs> he's on a mission, but you know, the thing I love about Hinks is uh, Hinks is a very care carefree character. Um, really uh, lighthearted uh, demeanor to him. Um, really kind of not a care in the world. Oh. It's kind of a scary thing. Kind of, because he, physically he's, uh, he's a badass, very menacing. But when you get a guy who's like really super badass and also really intelligent, but also is very carefree, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's kind, of a, kind of a scary thing. You get to do some crazy stunts, right? In the snow, in the mountains, you guys right. filmed. Can you talk a little bit about that choreography? Fight choreography? Yeah, I did a train in high altitude. But when you get in the high altitude where people are passing out, wow. it's a different thing. I and mean, there was a, a couple times where I was moving a little too fast, not being conscious of my breathing. You get a little woozy and a little lightheaded, man. It's a whole different experience. That's a pretty cool thing coming from the WWE, WWF for me. I'm a yeah. WWE world. James Bond, they actually reached out to us, which was a whole different thing. The pressure with this is you're familiar with the legacy, the tradition of Bond's, a whole different type of pressure. You know, also with the, the nature of, of, of the film itself, you know, being this international uh, spy thriller. There you have it, your all access look into Spectra, the new Bond film. This is Extra Butter, I'm Blogzilla, and we're out. Order those drinks, shake it. Not start.